Roger that. Well, you have fun with that game. Uh, it's gonna be a little short stream today, I think. We'll see how it goes. But plan for it to only be maybe an hour if we get that much sleep out of my son. Uh, we ended up yesterday morning doing what I don't know. Oh, we did um this the Dimension X thing, uh, and we did unlock a research top topic for that, even though the 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 corpses we got back didn't even didn't even make sense. But otherwise, uh, we are making over here. We are going to make. I'm going to turn the ravens off. I think I'm done with you and thunderstorms for sure, because tormentors are just better thunderstorms. We're going to need more Illyrium. I've been playing. Uh, my off-stream game has been Hitman. Is uh, free on PS Plus last month. It's actually pretty good. It's a lot of fun. I like the uh, all the challenges and stuff they give you to do. All right, Mass Driver Pistol. Uh, the Mass Driver Pistol is a very potent sidearm, firing small ferromagnetic bullets using an electromagnetic field instead of chemical explosives. The higher bullet velocity deals significant damage. You know what? You know what? This is very disappointing. Uh, the one on PS4. Just, it's just Hitman, I think. Let me uh, write a little note to Scorch right now, since we got this. And I'm just going to throw that in balance. <laughs> it's... Especially compared, you know, especially compared to uh, any of the Magnums. All right. I yeah, I guess twenty. Whichever one's on PS4. It's just called Hitman. And 2016, I consider that a still a new game, <laughs> as far as I'm concerned. All right, so 54. Uh, that was a horrible, horrible weapon. Let's get the Cyberweb HQ researched. We're not going to make any of those. I don't know. Your first mission is Paris, if that helps. And then Sapienza. I don't think I'm going to get all the trophies on that one, but I am going through and doing the, um, the suit only, don't be spotted, etc. challenge for each level. Those are the, Those are fun. Okay, 2018. 2018 and 2016 are basically the same year. All right, Peg is new Peg. And we got new case and hybrid officers. Let's get them training. And Peg. Nope, not, not Poochie. Peg, Peg. All right, look at the training. I mean, we're getting agents now rolling back in that are almost fully trained. We're really close. It's 90 stamina, 70 time units would be perfect. 80 firing accuracy. So you're basically fully trained. 56 skill, 79 strength. I think you are. You're good to go, Peg. Welcome back. May 9 be your lucky number. And we need to actually, we also need to... Um, did we get Eddie Power back? No, Eddie Power the third. <laughs> Eddie Power. Peg, Eddie Power. All right. Let's do this one real quick. Let's do that one. You do your thing. And then we can even see our distribution. So we have... See, our X's are finally... Look at that X distribution. So we have 17, 17, 16 of the above 50s and 788 of the belows so that's really nice and uh, we have three hybrid below 50s <laughs> one base uh, yeah we're getting that nice that nice distribution it's finally working out in our favor all right load that up let us we're researching gauss cannon Yes. Okay. Let's riots in Rio de Janeiro. Have we done riots? Members of the so-called cult have instigated a, a riot. A regular battle broke out between the rioters and the police. We have, 
Uh, but I can't. I just want to have fun with that. Let's just do something easy at the Devil's Den. Sort of uh, sit back, relax, get everyone's kills up. And it looks like it's the same crew. Yep, it's the same crew. I'm fine with that. Have we researched that yet? Yeah, let's bring one of these up. I want to see the damage output of those as well. Mass driver pistols are garbage. We can sell those. And let's sell some stuff here. Research the stoner LMG. I can't believe how bad the mass drivers are. Like, really bad. Which one is the Dagon staff? All right, yeah, that was the acid shooty one. Sell. Let's clean some stuff out. Oh, we can get rid of those. Keep those, keep those. I think I am done with jumpsuits. Yeah, we're done with jumpsuits. Did we research those yet? No. Keep those just on hand. These are garbage. <laughs> Gauss pistol, that'll be useful once we get that. And sonic weapons, man. I gotta research those. I sent them all over to this base for that research. Which one is the chemo gun? We we use it, but is it actually is it underwater capable? No. If it's underwater capable, we'll keep it. I don't like the toxic guns. We've gotta research that. Flash beam smoke. We haven't used smoke forever. All right, and our collection of corpses, we'll transfer those over if we ever need them. And our string corpse business suit, which we've had forever. <laughs> All right, send those over there. Anything else I could send over? I think that's it. I already moved everything of note that needed to be moved. Yeah. All right, let's go. Pink team. Because we're XCOM. <laughs> so why wouldn't we bring guns? Our goal is to save the police and kill the gangsters. It's a cult of apocalypse. So, I mean, they're going to have some real weapons. Or they should, at least. Yeah, they got the UAC stuff. Yeah, I'm just going to leave this all for reaction. Everyone but the dog. Everyone but the dog. Nine. No, we'll wait because you're still first turn. An electric tango artist? It's not a very unique name. There is another starving poet. I have to fight someone for it on almost every uh, console I've ever been on. I'm not, I can't, I'm not starving poet on Twitter, although I don't really use Twitter. And I wasn't starving poet on Eve either. <laughs> it's a big fight. All right, you can go ahead and throw this. Just get it out of your hand. I know, I'm more interested in this electric tango you're talking of. Tell me more. <laughs> One. Oh god, this is going to be a massacre. We've totally done this mission before. I just want to give you something that can react. I should give you a pistol. What is this train, by the way? Out of curiosity. Yeah, no, just skill. No, my other is, uh, my, if I can't get poet, I'm pwet. P-W-E-T-T, -T, which is from my old clan days. It was a nickname that someone gave me. Yeah, 
Yeah, I, I do want more reaction training while we're here. No, P W E T T, not Pweet. Yeah, we'll just do reactions. Reactions for everyone! Yeah, that's the one. You got it. It's my Swedish chef version. I think that was a UAC rocket launcher they just fired in an alleyway. Oh, uh, you can. I mean, that's it is one of my other monikers. It's my fault. My fallback. <laughs> Gosh, she's getting shot in the back of the head by a cop's pistol or something. This is working out nicely. I'll see you later, Ted. Dun, dun, dun. All right. I think, oh, I should check this. Uh, this is not an important clip, but I want to see if I fix the margins on this. No, you're not working? You can do it. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Ew, solid mushy cake. <laughs> All right, to that cat. Like, thank you for stopping by. All right, I fixed the margins. I just gotta make the picture a little bit bigger. Make the video window. No, the margins are still broken. Never mind. Why, guy? You gotta be that way. Why? All right. I hate CSS. Man, do I hate CSS. Let me just... Oh, I thought, like, this guy's a quip. That's badass. Alright, dog. Uh, you can get this one. You know what? You, I guess you need a little bit more melee training to get that off the list. Does this train reactions, by the way? Yeah, it does. Sweet. The other one just trains bravery. That's the difference. All right. Toothless shark. One, two, and three. Oh, that poor policeman. One. Is that a bad dog? No, that's a good dog. Besides, I can do this. Just turn your head. No, <laughs> you can't see him anyway. Never mind. Can I mind control a civilian dog? Turn your head. No. He is invisible to me. Uh, see bad guy? Anyone in here, for chance? That door's open, so maybe. Aha! One and two. Alright, Blix, you got that. We'll do that. Reaction fire with the missiles. Always a good idea. Alright, shark. And you are just a power suit, not flying at all. All right. That works.
You can make that shot. I don't think the shotgun's gonna do it. I don't think it does a reaction shot if it's a 0% chance to hit. There we go. I think the last time we did this mission, we just sort of camped out for the first two turns while the police died. <laughs> oh, and I didn't even notice we got through the first turn without any civilians dying. That's insane. Oh, yeah, come towards me. Do it. actually kill someone. What is going on here? <laughs> Was there a stealth buff to civilians? Oh my goodness. All right. One, two, and three. Well, definitely for you. You see anything? I was going to clear these buildings away with uh, explosives, but I figure if the civilians are doing so well, all right, we are down three civilians, two knocked out, and one is bleeding. We'll try to find you. I mean, we're going to we're going to heal everyone, I think. That goes without saying. Talk about training opportunities. This is one of them. One and two. Oh, nice. Unfortunately, I don't think I can see if they're bleeding unless they're laying down. So we have to wait for them to pass out, if nothing else. Take out the priest. Oh no, Tokyo Wartooth. Always a signal. Oh, it's a UAC rifle. Uh, I should have expected that. We'll leave you there. Revenge! But again, our dogs always die in one hit. I mean, technically, yes, it is. The uh, the three days of rain have stopped over here. And the flooding has slowed down because everything froze again last night. But it's really sunny, which totally makes it okay. I love killing with a punch. The good news, though, all I think all the dogs in training are fully trained, so they're probably better than the ones we have now. They just need their secondaries topped off. You got a snap left? No, you don't. Now we almost got through that roof. Seeing the tear from the deep, uh, like, vacationing guy with an axe is always odd. Very weird. <laughs> A 
The dog's putting in the work over there. All right, everyone here bled out who I was going to save. That's a darn shame. I'll leave you there since you can see two. And you. One, two, three. Let's just move you a bit closer. You just take care of that guy, specifically. <laughs> that one guy. Uh, that's your job. A little more Fublex. That works. That works. Check out this dude. Nothing. A little bit farther. And Dorgo. Oh, hello. A baseball bat and an axe. It's good stuff. <laughs> That's what I think he was going for at these levels specifically. It's really dangerous early on when you're supposed to do these missions. I think that was a civilian. Fairly certain. <laughs> two, two reaction shots from that guy. <laughs> hey, Eddie, how's it going? All is going well. All is going well. We just got your clone ordered in. Eddie the third. Current score is one for three. It's just, uh, you know what? We get a reaction training. We still lost a dog, but <laughs> one of these runs is going to have to work out for you eventually, Eddie. <laughs> one of them. There might be something in that corner. I'll have him look. Otherwise, we'll just keep walking. Oh, you are a bad guy. All right. Well, we revived you to save you. That's pretty much our MO here. I will go ahead and... Daw. All right, that one. So be it. Little Pattern is going to get his skill training up. Maybe at E3 won't be an X, though, so that's always an option. We'll see. Avenge the puppy. God, that one is so high-pitched. It is so high pitched. <laughs> that woman screams in tinnitus. All right. Just keep moving forward. 
We'll get them all. Any more healing to do? Right over there. Anzark. You'll almost make it. Two and three. This guy's not moving. Well, I guess we'll take this opportunity then to get your skill. Might be someone in that corner as well. There we go. Police are police are doing their thing. Oh, that is good training right there. Oh, there's one in the corner. Can you go grab that guy? Nothing there. Anyone not with experience? No. one. Aha, way over there with a UAC rifle. How's your arm, M. Sherman? Not good. <laughs> not, not great. Uh, two? Eh? You're uh, very, very consistent. Very precise, it's not accurate. All right, your turn. There we go. <laughs> hey, Otto, how's it going? Yeah, this is a uh, this isn't fair, I think, is the best way to put this. healing to be done. And you're almost out. <laughs> and even more healing to be done. Excellent. I miss, I do miss the days of healing with the rum and then hitting them with the rum to make more wounds and then healing them with the rum again. Those were the glory days of Aggressive medic duty. Nothing else really comes close. Uh, it's not so bad. We had a freeze last night, so everything, you know, with the fans on, it's enough to keep any water from actually pooling. So it, it could be way worse. Could be way worse. I'm sure my neighbors are flooding completely. We spent a lot of money when we moved in to redo all the landscaping around the house. So most of the water <laughs> gets, gets shunted away. But when you have feet of snow piled up against the house, there's not much you can do to stop the dampness. Are you the last one? Nope. Uh, so, 
if it thaws without having like a big rain thaw, if it thaws slowly, then it will th it will um, come down. Like the the ground will thaw with it, and it'll actually go into the ground. It was just it was just the rain itself that did it. We have never had a year where it has snowed this much this late, followed immediately by such a phenomenal rainstorm. It's a bad year. That's the first year where they've closed off the streets, or had parking restrictions at last past the storm. In like 15 years, I think. I think we can cheat through the wall with that gun, so let's go ahead and just heal that guy up. My next thing, my next plan is I wanna... I gotta tear up this basement floor anyway because it is not level and extremely old. And uh, put in a drain tile system around the outside. And that'll take care of any of this water that just likes to seep through the walls. There we go. All right, good reactions. Everyone and Zerk got the bravery we were looking for. Not really high in the... Not really high on the uh, accuracy gains. I'll take it. Lost the dog. To reaction fire. Have we researched a wrench we have? Oh, and yeah, that, those are projects that I will not do. That's what I pay people for, right? Civilian? Can that even be... Researched? I just have a civilian. <laughs> There's no topic. There's no... I'll hold on to him. Just to have. Just because... Oh, Torki. Toki. Toki does have a better uh, win-loss ratio than uh, than Eddie, though. And he's a dog. <laughs> we'll, get, we'll get him up and queued. All right. Let us go. Gauss pistol. This one-handed Gauss weapon is able to penetrate virtually any armor known to Earth science, holding that, including that of vehicles. Yeah, that's, that is like, this is a bad weapon. Oh, those aren't errors. Those are, um, that is the arrays and how everything is distributed to keep everything balanced out. This needs to be better, I think. In case someone manages to get mass drivers without Gauss. I don't know how that would happen, but... Bad weapon. This is much better to carry around. That's nice damage right there. And I think... Might even be more useful than the rifle. Not sure. I think I'm going to replace the rifles with the... Um, with the heavies, though. If we ever find one. If the Gauss pistols are a... Uh, yes. Let's take a look at that. Do I have any here? Uh, Gauss rifles. Gauss. I do. So let's see if they can be concealable. Because that would be a nice concealable weapon. Oh, yeah. There. That answers that question. That is that. I'll get the ammo researched. Can I research you? I cannot. I'm just going to hold, hold him in my... Uh, that little base where it rears itself. You're free to go. <laughs> they are, they're better than any earth rifle. Basically. Gauss pistol clip. Excellent. Alright, let's do fast stuff in this base. No, oh, perfect. I actually wanted to research that. And I want that. What base is that? 
No, that base. Cool. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I mean, they look fake enough, right? No one would even think twice. I have enough pistols. Let's make some ammo. God, they're practically free. All right. Well, there's a nice concealable weapon for us. Acid pistols. Gas-operated weapon shoots deadly corrosive fluid from the intakes on the body. Air is chambered and pressurized to be then used to expel the projectile. It's a fart gun. The weapon can repeat this pr process several, t countless times. Although this sounds simple, the miniature pressurizers are very complex and potent. Excuse me, which I guess is a way to say we can't make them. Acid pistol clip. Cyberweb HQ. We have located the Cyberweb's HQ hidden in the Dimension X. It is not a base, though. It is a giant airship capable of opening a dimensional gate and wreaking chaos on Earth. As it can simply escape into Dimension X when engaged by our craft, we must assault this battleship when it is grounded for maintenance. Until we complete this operation, we must ensure that Earth's skies are well defended from its incursions. Be careful, the Council will hate every second of this ship hanging up in Earth's atmosphere. Don't screw this up, Commander. The future of XCOM depends on it. Do we learn about the ship itself? Let's get these things out of the way. Oh, perfect. Gauss Cannon. The Gauss Cannon is the apogee of kinetic weapon technology. It's bullets darting through the air at hypersonic speeds. I mean, lots of bullets travel at hypersonic speeds. All right, uh, damage 150 at 21 kilometers. So it's a double laser cannon is what it is. Way more accurate, though. And faster. <laughs> faster rate of fire. That's a nice little weapon. Can I put this on the lightning? All right, what do I want? I don't really want those. I don't really want that. Let's get the heavy plasma researched. I mean, honestly, what really gave us a threat with the heavy stingrays? Battleships, maybe? And K9 is finished. All right, let's... Uh... I really wish I could put Gauss Cannons on there. We can hide those. We saw those, and we said no thanks. And get rid of those. Actually, no, because these are all avalanches. We'll do avalanches. Dun, dun. Oh, we can buy some power armor. Let's buy some of these. I totally forgot about those. Um, Where can I use them? I guess I don't know. So these are anti-kinetic weapons. So these will be good underground. So let's buy a whole set for our underground crew here. And they have a maintenance fee of 25000 a month. But what do we care? What do we care about those? Don't need that. Don't need these. These are all garbage, man. Even that one. All garbage. Garbage, garbage. Garbage, 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 garbage. Oh, goodbye, Thrashers. <laughs> goodbye, Heavy Cannons. I don't need you anymore. I'll keep the Auto Cannons up. Black Ops Assault Cannon. Never use those. We still use those. Right. See ya, Auto. Thanks for stopping by. All right. And let's buy some Gauss cannons. They had, these have two. These take a lot of space, don't they? Oh, not so bad. Not as bad as the other stuff. Each one of the 60. Let's just buy 16 for now. Like, I don't even need the missiles. Because it's a heavy, right? Yeah, it's a heavy. I don't even need them. At all. Although we are going to spend the time to make these tormentors everywhere. I like them. I like them. 
All right, Eddie Power number three. What do you look like? No, your replacement is an X. Are you here? Eddie Power number three, also an X. Ooh, 37, man. 37. Yeah, up to 57, though, when fully trained. Horrible reactions. Poor bravery. <laughs> Otherwise, trained up pretty nicely. Almost on training as well. All right, good luck on Eddie Power number three. Good luck. I'll throw you to the top of the list. <laughs> All right, let's throw. Oh, none available. That's fine. I'll throw a new Eddie on there. I gotta fix that. Oh, so that is a new string for in the base, but not training because you're wounded, I think. Oh, that full string is. All right. Let's run through these again to make sure they are all being utilized. Sixty-five, seventy-five, eighty-one. Let's sort by who has the worst. <laughs> you have one skill at seven. That's great. Seventy-nine and twenty. Let's get you going. Actually, you're worse. All right, and double check. All of those. Actually, we'll check those if we get any soldiers in there. Hey, Izord, how's it going, man? I think uh, these take four days to build. I think I can afford to get rid of a workshop and put another uh, Sonic Lab in here. I would love to get rid of... I have 11 extra. Let's get rid of these 11 extra engineers. Maybe I can just get rid of an extra living quarter. What are we at? 312. I had 12 extras. I mean, I can do that. That's fine. I'd like 267. Yeah, I'm cool with that. Instead of getting rid of a whole workshop. And we can get rid of one living quarter. Well, not yet. Let's build a, a lab. Can Psy Labs be destroyed? Do they have a destructible item in them? How can I move this around? Well, you know, we don't have base defenses anymore. So it doesn't really matter. Ah, yes. And we just did the uh, base... Assault yesterday as well. So that's in the the Dimension X base assault in yesterday's stream. Alright. Actually gonna put a dog back on training. Oh why thank you, Baronade. That is the one thing I haven't updated is my uh my bits. I need a background for the bits. <laughs> that goes with this theme. I do appreciate it though. Thank you very much. All right. And where did you go? It was Devil's Den, right? I wish I could train dogs. <laughs> I wish I could give them some skill. Mm, you're so close to being maxed out. There's no point. Oh, man, that... Yeah, I wouldn't, I wouldn't even do it. There's no way. Acid Pistol Clip. This biological mixture of highly reactive compounds is used as ammunition for the acid pistol. It is filled with microorganisms which constantly maintain the highest possible acidity of its microenvironment. Ugh. Uh, yeah, I would 100% not do that without power suits. Not like you get anything useful out of it anyway. I mean, you can get a couple, you know, whatchamacallits. Oh, the Centurion. So we... Do have I think that screen was broken. <laughs> the stone LMG researched. Like that. Uh US machine gun fired uh from the Vietnam War era, discontinued in favor of the FN Mini Me due to high unit cost. <laughs> it's, it's new, that's why it's there. You need to complete the game right, but it doesn't give you anything. There you go. Thank you, Katnik. 
<laughs> Welcome back. Did you unfollow and follow me? <laughs> <Just for the minute. laughs> gotcha. Well, you get to see the new the new alerts I've been working on. I've been having a lot of fun with those. All right. Let's get the Zarbite tank out of the way. And power armor for our Reptoid missions. Throw you... Did you finish that as well? Man, that was fast. All right, we'll throw you on the Centurion. Zarbite tank. This alien device contains an exotic, highly energetic material called Zarbite. Well, thank you. <laughs> That's very informative. Can you tell me about this Zarbite that you have found? Let's get uh, the Stormtrooper armor research. Zarbite tank disassembly. And do I have any Zarbite? Oh, wow. I have bio extraction, though. <laughs> okay. Let's, uh, you know what? Let's clear this out. Just a Reaper corpse that's hanging around. It's the only thing I can make in this base. Can I do bio extraction because I have... <laughs> no, it's just a new uh, low level, a uh, low level H uh, LMG. Right, you don't have... Yeah, you do not have... I got. I wish we had something to put there. It makes me sad. Can we... And then just replace these? Aw. <laughs> just let me throw the other one on there and it would work fine. The Gauss Cannon. So it takes two to load it up. Do we have auxiliary thrusters already at these bases? What base has both? Oh, Q base, that's right. Shog village discovered. Which one's a Shog village? Military settlement, non human sapiens living underground, ponds of darkness, yada, 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 yada. All right. So that is a lightning mission. And we can use our new armor. Oh, we're going to stick with kills for a while. <laughs> Eddie Power the third. Good luck, buddy. <laughs> Quick Mind, Airhawk, Ian, Aziz. I sword you. Oh, you're wounded. That's right. Uh, no dogs. Bill Shortchange, Steve, and Elmer. The dogs are kind of retired at this point. They're there for, like, any human missions that pop up. Fox Muldoon. Holy Right, 182 kills. Power armor? Is that? Yeah, power armor. We could have given it a different name. Like Magma Suit, right? That would have been a lot easier to keep track of. All right. 100 armor all around except for the butt with 80% kinetic, 80% uh, concussive. Extra cutting damage for some reason. I was not expecting that, but they don't have any cutting weapons. Low EMP, low electric, extra warp, extra warp, and low stun. All right. I'll just bring, we'll bring some, oh, we have so much Gauss pistol ammo. We don't have many weapons that do more damage than the Gauss pistols. It's more of a, <laughs> it's more of an accuracy thing at that point. All right, I don't think we'll use the incinerator underground. All right, Mr. Lightning. They don't have the grenades, though. <laughs> do not have the grenades. Oh, do we have night vision? Didn't even look for that. 
12. Alright, that's kind of shitty. I gotta fix that. There's no reason for that to... There's no reason for these not to have lights. Someone forced me to put lights on all these things. Uh, actually, I don't want you there, do I? No, you're there for now. These armor suits actually look rather nice. You don't need to be on the front line. You can shoot through things. He totally changed these starting positions to be less uh, campy, didn't he? Oh, the chunk. That would have been good. All right, we're going to do two turns. He's awake. As I predicted. I want to see what we're fighting. Because there are more uh, underground enemies that we haven't seen. I've seen them on Quick Mind streams. A very, very short stream. I apologize for it. I'm trying to squeeze them in because I, I need to finish this game. Uh, not the best. This might be the best armor versus projectiles during p versus piercing and concussive ammo, but not the best armor in the game. The Juggernaut suit might be better. We can take a look at that as soon as this turns over. And I think Quick Mind is still going right now too, so we can all just I'll just hop over there, send the host over. So the Juggernaut. There it is. Show me your jugs. The Juggernaut has more front armor and is better versus um, plasma, basically. And this would be the better underwater weapon, I think, as well. Because it has the... Uh, you know what? I don't think the power armor is actually that much worse. It has uh, a little bit less rear armor. They're pretty similar. That's not from Terror from the Deep. No, that... Uh, the Terror from the Deep armor is like... Ooh. All right, we are... F ooh, that is like centipede people versus ant-men. All right, we will be facing ant-men. Do they have any projectile weapons? No, just concussive. Let's take a peek out here. Quick peek around. Quick mind, you're going to be capturing, trying to stun these guys. Do these fly? Are those jump jets in there? Can't run. Can't kneel. <laughs> I don't think it flies. But the nice thing about these armors is I just buy them. So that's always a bonus. Alright. <laughs> they do not have a lot of armor. <laughs> Let's see how they do versus lasers. They'll do one more turn. Everyone's away from the doors. Is that in range? I might as well get a free kill if I can, right? No. Bill, why don't you come over here? With Eddie. Why am I? Oh, Eddie's up front. <laughs> That's not a good sign. Eddie, I said I'd keep you in the back. Get, get some kills on you. I'd let you live. Straight to the face versus 100 armor. Couple hits. Oh, 
All right, laser rifle took him down. They are not armor heavy. They do have the time units, though. Yeah, what? No, there you go. <laughs> Color me not surprised. It's probably that hammer those things eat through armor. You gotta scream when you when you do that. Do you guys realize that two people from Predator were governors? Like, isn't that a weird a weird thing? <laughs> Just to think about. Alright, let's uh quick mind. Come on, quick mind. I know you could do this. Uh, you hit them. You hit them all, and only one of those did damage. Jesse Ventura, man. He was, oh crap, I did not mean to do that, Ian. I tried to click off. Now Ian might go down. Now you're closest. And you missed. I am not kidding. He went crazy, too. Like, literally crazy. How'd that work? That worked out very nicely. Alright. I think Quickmind is kind of safe here. Or not Quickmind, uh... Eddie Powers. Well, I the difference is one was a professional bodybuilder and one was a professional wrestler. Different takes on how you get and maintain that size, right? It's actually a safe place. Oh, wait, no. There's a way out. Right, let's face that way. I am so sorry, Ian. I did not mean for this to happen. Uh, da, 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 da. I'm gonna put that cudgel in my hand. Is it a one-handed or two-handed? All right, it's expensive to use, but that does nice damage. Still does less total damage than the alloy sword, but has a better average. Hope they don't have explosives. And we'll get you healed next turn. Let's do this turn, and then we'll call it for the day. Actually, did not want you to shoot with those reactions. There's a lot of Ant-Man here. I wish burning corpses emit light. I, that would be like one of my one of my dream things. All right, that worked out well. All right, we are going to leave on this note. Yeah, mind control you. At this range, it's worth trying. Yes, I can. Let's take a look. Ant-Man Worker. You have uh, no armor. Good, Really good strength. Good psionic strength as well, actually. Pretty decent. Bring you a quick peek to get healed. Just shove the medkit through the holes in your armor. Now, there would be an armor. Well, I guess we had the medic suits already for healing. So that wouldn't be that big of a deal. Never mind. Right, quick mind, I need you. Take some snapshots then. I think we're just 
very resistant to stun, and I can't seem to do anything with them. How are you to EMP? Let's just take a look. For science. I got a wound left. That's right. Two, three, four. I would like to get you guys first, though. I need you to not miss. Crush their hearts. Just die like the rest of them. Oh, hey, it's Eddie Power with a bad guy right in front of him. What are the odds? <laughs> what are the odds of that? All right, one more heart crush. Actually, Eddie, let's bring you back a little bit farther. I will keep you alive. It's my one goal. And we don't have any sense that I can see. I'll leave you here, actually, just to be my decoy. You stay right there. All right. And with that note, we will take a break. Sorry for the short stream. I do appreciate you guys stopping by. Uh, I got to find some time to record some Darkest Dungeon this week. We did Wolf, and I got to do one more mission before the recording is up, so you can look forward to that. Otherwise, if I don't see you tomorrow, I will see you Monday or Tuesday. Adios, guys. If you're still here, I want to take a moment to say thank you for watching. Please leave a comment or click